I'm just about to set off for our camping trip and of course it's just started raining. Typical. Good morning guys, how are you all doing? I've still got all of that to put in the car and the boot's just about full already. I spent a good half an hour yesterday filling the car up but there's plenty of room for all of this stuff. I'm just uh, having a morning coffee. I've just had some breakfast. I've walked Harley. He sat there content. He won't be in a bit when we set off. He'll no doubt be doing his usual whining in the back of the car. Whatever. I'm just uh, doing my final check, going around the house looking for things that I might need. One of them I realised is a comb because I still haven't had this chopped off. I just couldn't be bothered. <laughs> uh, maybe I need that. Yeah, I'll take it anyway. That can go in that bag. I've already got my raincoat and umbrella because I figured I'm going to need them. Turns out I'm right. But I've just been taking Harley out for his morning walk and it was dry as a bone, nothing. And then I felt something hit my head and I'm like, there's a bird poop there. And then another drip and I'm like, oh no, come on. And now it's raining. Or is it? Yep, still raining. I've got a feeling this is going to be a wet holiday. We are now at our first pit stop. It's called Scotch Corner. Been here numerous times. It's a good place to have a pit stop. Harley's happy that he's running around. And he's been very good as well. He's only whined maybe once or twice and said to him, just be quiet, just lay down. And eventually he did. It was nice and quiet for most of the way up the motorway. I'm only going to stay here for a a short while just need to have a drink maybe have a chocolate bar <laughs> it's currently just turned eight o'clock so we've been on the road for just over an hour and a half set off at half six i did want to set off at six but by the time i really sorted myself out and sorted all the stuff out for the car it turned out to be half past six oh well done well i mean there's been road works that slowed us down a bit but as for the traffic it's been pretty much going the whole way i just hope it keeps up oh, and as for the rain it keeps coming and going right now it's not here but it is a bit on the cold side i'm just realizing i think i'm gonna go get a coffee it might warm me up just seeing a starbucks sign <laughs> this place is pretty look at that wow I'm uh, keeping Harley on the lead because of all of them. Oh, they're already moaning. <laughs> yeah, this nice little dog walking area. Be quiet, we're not going anywhere near you. <laughs> Shut up! We're now at, well, we're near Locker Bay. Um, the reason I stopped is because I'm very, very hungry. And remember when I said oh, there's a, a Starbucks sign at the last place? It turned out it was Starbucks on the go, which means it'll be in the petrol station where it's cans or whatever. So I didn't bother. I think I'll uh, see if I can find a coffee and some food in here. Shouldn't be difficult, there's a McDonald's. <laughs> Mind you, I'm, I'm not particularly fond of McDonald's breakfast, so I don't know. I might just get a sandwich or something. Ow, I'm not gonna be able to walk any further. The path is flooded. I'm not exactly in the right shoe wear. Uh, yeah, come out of there. I don't want you getting all muddied up. And yes, it's raining once again. Ugh. It's funny, I got on the M6 and I thought, oh, it won't be long before I'm at Glasgow and then eventually Loch Lomond. Oh, no, 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 no. I saw a sign saying, Glasgow, 95 miles. I'm like, what? <laughs> uh, I'm sure I'll not need to have another break after I've had a coffee and some food. Yet another break. And this time, 
it's at Loch Lomond. Check it out. Been here a few times before. In fact, I'm pretty certain I've vlogged here before as well. Check out the clouds going across Ben Lomond. And there's uh, a lot of rain over there. It's been coming and going still, so the car gets soaked. I just want to go down here and see how Harley is on this platform because the last time <laughs> it was funny, it made me laugh. Let's see if he does it again. Are you going to go across? Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing it again. <laughs> oh dear. It still makes me laugh. Come on. <laughs> You're not going to fall in! Oh by the way, going through Glasgow was a nightmare. The traffic was horrendous. Took a while but we finally got through. Also, don't you like being on here? Do you want to keep going? Fine, we need to anyway. We are at our final pit stop, I hope. One of my favourite places. We're not far from uh, Glencoe which is up this way. But this is a beautiful site. I don't know the name of this lock, unfortunately. I'll have to find out. In fact, I can have a look on the map. We'll find out exactly where I am. I've been here a few times and I just don't know. I believe we are here, next to Lock Tula. So I've just got to go up here, past Glencoe, which is there, and up to our destination. And something tells me he wants to get back in the car. Yeah, are you getting wet? Yeah. So am I. So I'm just going to get a photo or two and then get off because I need to get out of this rain. Not only am I getting wet, the camera is as well. Ugh. I wasn't going to stop again but the rain's stopped for the moment. I'm in Glencoe and I've never actually stopped here to take photos. Not properly anyway. Look at that. Wow. It's beautiful. Amazing. I think I actually did stop once on the side of the road in a parking bay just to get a photo. But I'm pretty sure it was way over there. I've never actually stopped here. I'm so glad I have. I'm gonna get some photos of this. Quickly for two reasons. One, that's more rain. But two, this wind is cold. <laughs> Ta da the tent is up. Wow, it's that big, I can't fit it in the screen. <laughs> there we go. He's happy, aren't you? It's just turned, well, 10 past six now. I've had the tent up maybe half an hour now. I just needed to rest and go wash my hands. They were black. I remember some of you were asking where I was going to be staying. You see that mountain there? Well, that's Ben Nevis. Once again, I'm stopping at Glen Nevis Caravan and Camping Park. Been here before. Was here three years ago with Joe, Pete and Archie. I think that vlog was called In Scotland or something like that. I also stayed here 10 years ago with Joe, just over there in her pop-up tent. And I clearly remember we got here, we pitched the tent and we're like, what should we do now? We walked all the way up to the top of Ben Nevis and then back down again and that was the day after we did the Great Yorkshire Run so in fact that was 10 years ago in two days so I'm hoping to do it again because he needs to complete the three peak challenge don't you? he's done Snowden and Scaffold Pike he needs to do Ben Nevis just depends on the weather what's the matter with you? eh? what? you've already eaten I need to eat I'm hungry yeah I'm gonna Get all the stuff in here because I've not done that yet. <laughs> and I have to say, this tent looks very, very filthy. Look at this all on the seams and on here and on here. The first place I spotted it was out here on there, and I know why that is. It's because when I packed up the tent last year, it was raining and I've not had it out since, so it's not been aired out or anything. So one day I'm going to have to open it up and clean it. I've just noticed 
this is all scummy as well Ugh. and creased maybe I should get iron out <laughs> I'm now gonna get my stuff out like I said I'm gonna have my tea get this vlog edited and then probably go to bed I'm pooped that was a long drive I'm going to do it back again on Saturday. Fun. At least on the bright side, it stopped raining when I was putting the tent up. That's a good thing. It hasn't started again since. But there's every chance it will. Anyway guys, I'm going to sign off now. I need to sit down, I'm exhausted. <laughs> With that being said, I will now say thank you for watching and subscribing if you have. And liking this video if you did. Until tomorrow, <laughs> peace out. I've just realised I should have brought a mop. It's muddy out there. He's brought it in. And so have I. <sighs> this tent's going to need a jet wash. <laughs>